Good Gospel Day to you and yours. You're locked in to the great inspirational programming on the Rose Highland Sharp Gospel Show. Now tell me what can walk What can make me whole again? I know that is nothing, nothing but the blood of Jesus. Jesus, that's the reason I say, oh, precious oh, is the flow that makes me wise. blood of the lamb is their power
well, 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 it is the blood of Jesus that keeps me and it's going to carry me on from one degree to the next in our Lord and Savior Christ Jesus. Amen, amen, and good gospel Sunday morning to you and yours. You're in tune to the Rose Highland Sharp Gospel Show, and of course, I'm your lady, Gospel Master, Blaster for the Master, and if you're listening on this June 3rd, 2018 weekend, good gospel Sunday to you, or whenever you might be listening, because this, of course, um, program is available to you, accessible 24 hours a day, forever and ever a day (laughs) amen we heard this morning kicking off our music program uh, Sandra Crouch in the beginning of the hour power in the blood and of course Nisi yeah that's the lady's name there is power in the blood love that still to come we've got new music from Ruth Laantra ah yes a new uh, nice little piece that's upbeat upstep and it's entitled I Got You uh, for the Ty Scott record label thank you Ty Scott for continuing to send me music as you get an opportunity for the Rose Highland Sharp Gospel Show if you're listening in the Sand Hills area of North Carolina uh, weather forecast for today on Sunday uh, the 3rd of June 2018 a 70% chance of rain high temperatures at about 86 degrees and a low at 64 that's not bad listen certainly hope you had a great and beautiful Memorial Day and we remember those who uh, sacrificed and gave their life who served in the United States Armed Forces and those families that yet remain those in all the wars uh, as we remember you amen uh this past week and all the celebrations that took place in our various municipalities in every state and around the nation yes indeed in this half hour we're going to keep the program a little short today as i said sometimes it's about uh, 30 hours and sometimes you get an hour of power and of course sometimes you're hearing the broadcast via hype hop radio as well so today through my of course as always on the rose highland sharp youtube i'm going to be talking a little bit about guarding your heart um the peace of god and, and a little something that i've been experiencing of late and just wanted to share with you a little bit of that message today so this is a shorter uh, broadcast and uh, tell your family friends and your foes that means your enemies to tune in to this great gospel program and of course celebrating ooh, kind of losing count Uh, in this year since 1985 so you figure out the math on that one so what is that what's uh, 33 years and counting in the the gospel uh, radio and and radio broadcasting period and I thank God for all those who gave me the opportunity and one day I'll tell you a little bit more about that let's get back to the great gospel music and of course let's remember the sick and shut-ins and those imprisoned the poor, the widowed indeed, and the orphaned. You, you, and you, and everybody that we pray one for another and do what we need to do with the gifts that God has given us. Amen. To help our brother and sister along the way. Let's go to that new music, I Got You, by Ruth Laantra.
And to God be the glory. <laughs> Amen. I'm ready to view that city risen. Amen. And great music and new music from La Antra. Ruth La Antra, I got you. And I thank God that we've got the Lord in our life. If you don't, I pray that you will. Thank you for tuning in to the Rose Highland Sharp Gospel Show. What a day, what a day, what a beautiful day here in our community of the Sand Hills of North Carolina, where I am recording. Today, of course, we've been featuring music from the Gospel Heritage CD, uh, 2005 uh, uh, release, and, of course, music featured from the 1980s, 1990s, and the early 2000s, and, of course, released in 2018, Ruth La Antra, I Got You. Like that little peppy song there. <laughs> Amen. Amen. All right. I'm going to take a look, see at some things happening in the community. Once again, we, we are thankful for our Memorial Day celebrations throughout the nation. And we do salute our fallen U.S. military. And we continue to pray for the families. Congratulations to the class of 2018, the high school and college students, wherever you are. We're so proud of you and those from our own hometown of Taylortown, North Carolina, outside of Pinehurst, North Carolina. Celebration for Pinecrest High School 2018 graduate uh, David Brown and his fellow classmates that are Teletown residents will be held 
by his father, Ronald Brown, at the Johnny Bowler Municipal Park in the Taylortown Municipality, June 9th, beginning at 11 a.m. A cookout, swimming, and basketball are all scheduled. Message Ronald Brown on Facebook if you like to attend. This summer, the Food Bank of Central and Eastern North Carolina, of course, is looking for churches and community centers to host a free feeding program for children. Eligible food sites are needed to distribute these free breakfasts and lunches in the neighborhood. To apply, you can contact Jessica Ledbetter at the Food Bank Central and Eastern North Carolina at the Southern Pines, North Carolina site by calling 910-692-5959, extension 2404. The Southern Pines Men's Service Club has uh, some raffle tickets for a chance to win a 50-inch TV or a gift certificate. How about that? And the proceeds benefit the club's scholarship fund. For more information, contact Chris Thomas at Blunt's Barbershop at 910-246-0030 or Aubrey Simon at Simon Funeral Home at 910-692-3701. The drawing will be held June 15th at Down Memory Lane and you do not have to be present to win and of course all of this is in the Moore County area of North Carolina, Southern Pines, Pinehurst area for your FYI. Amen. Let's remember the family Amen of Cliffordine uh, Harris uh, Beatty. Uh, she was originally from Taylortown, North Carolina, and of course resided many years, a retired teacher in Greensboro, North Carolina. She passed away about a week ago. Funeral services were held in Greensboro, and she's laid to rest back in Taylortown, North Carolina, to the Harris Hedden Beatty uh, family, to her husband, uh, her daughter, grandchildren, and cousins, and all connecting family members. Uh, we continue to lift you up before the Lord. All of the bereaved and grieved families, we're praying for you and our sick and shut in, the imprisoned. Uh, you, you and you are widowed indeed and orphaned and the poor. Those in need of employment, a second chance in life, we are praying so much for you. I mentioned earlier down memory lane, uh, which is off of highway number five behind the bowling alley, uh, Aberdeen, Pinehurst, North Carolina, uh, right there on highway number five. And, uh, that said, there's going to be a great uh, program, a gospel show by Whisk Entertainment. Uh, that is, of course, uh, Pauline Ross, formerly of the Eastwood community and, of course, residing in Charlotte, North Carolina. She's been doing a series of entertainment uh, programs at Down Memory Lane uh, in Pinehurst. And if you're listening, June the 3rd, uh, that's tonight. If you're listening, June 3rd, 2018, 4 until 7 p.m., a gospel show featuring a Jeffrey McCoy, great musician, uh, Minister Maria Lee, who's a soloist, gospel singer, and uh, gospel uh, comedian. Uh, Brother Mac, originally from Taylortown, North Carolina, he's a gospel comedian, and others will be there performing. It's good, f clean family fun, and just a very small uh, donation fee to get in uh, to see this wonderful program on tonight, June 3rd, 4 to 7 p.m. Tell Pauline Ross that you heard it on the Rose Highland Sharp Gospel Show. All right, also coming up uh, this week in our community announcements, uh, my dear homegirl, Aura, uh, Minister Aura Cookie Watkins, a member at St. Peter Deliverance Church of God in Christ, located off Indiana Avenue, Southern Pines, North Carolina. Of course, she's going to be the speaker. Uh, at the church anniversary celebration this coming Friday, June 8th, 7.30 p.m. The pastor, Bishop Ricky Smith, of course, invites everybody to be a part and looks forward to seeing you there. Amen, amen. You can always look at my uh, Facebook. I have community pages connected to my Rose Highland Sharp Facebook with community announcements in the Sand Hills of North Carolina, Moore County, and you certainly will get a lot of out of that information all right and i do connect it to other pages as well a word for you from the lord today in our scripture reading we're going to keep the program short and the message short the book of philippians um, chapter four and as i'm reading uh beginning with verse four to verse seven again philippians in the new testament chapter four 
verses four through seven. Rejoice in the Lord always. And again, I say rejoice. Let your moderation be known unto all men. The Lord is at hand. Be careful for nothing, but in everything by prayer and supplication with thanksgiving, let your request be made known unto God. And the peace of God, which passeth all understanding, shall keep your hearts and minds through Christ Jesus. Amen. And my message basically coming from verse 7, uh, peace of God and the peace of God, which passeth all understanding, shall keep your hearts and minds through Christ Jesus. The peace of God, nothing missing, nothing broken, and peace that will steady your feet. You know, the peace, that's one of those, uh, put it on the full arm of God. You know, we got the salvation on your head and the all the others, the, the sword, the word, uh, faith the shield of faith and the breastplate of righteousness and truth girt about around your lawns and peace at your feet that you're steady and and steadfast and immovable and not missing and you're not getting uh out of joint about things having that kind of peace that nobody can understand and that your hearts hallelujah to keep your hearts and minds through christ jesus that your hearts are kept that your heart and your mind are guarded that nobody the devil can't touch your heart and your mind and he's going to mess with you a little bit that's what he does that's what he does that's his honest job but you being a christian if you know the lord jesus christ is your personal savior rooted and grounded in the word you are reading your word rightly dividing the word of truth my goodness gracious and studying and the word is abiding in you and you're abiding in the word that's god almighty word uh, in, incarnate of uh, jesus christ who walked this earth died and rose for our sin and jesus the word of the lord from the beginning genesis to revelation that you know that you have peace your heart is guarded your mind is guarded too in the name of jesus the whatever that you need and you're careful that you pray and give god thanks in all things amen amen this past season of my life this past week or two i've seen some miracles in my own life i've seen miracles throughout my life God never changes. Same God yesterday, today, and forevermore. Working miracles. Don't give up on your prayers, saints. Those who listen to the sound of my voice, even if you're not deeply rooted in the church yet, start reading your Bible. Find the church that you will be led and fed and you can go to. Don't forsake the assembling of yourself or other believers. That's the word of the Lord. Let the Lord lead you by his spirit. No matter what you did, who you did it to, what was did to you, God has given you another chance. And believe you're praying. Now, are you praying in the will of God? Now, that comes from studying and reading his word and studying. Amen. And that faith walk, reading and studying his word, that faith walk and being led by the Holy Spirit. But I can say in my life, as I have prayed for people, not only in my family, but people that I didn't know well, but God put them in my spirit for classmates and colleagues and coworkers and neighbors and church family. Those in the neighborhood for myself, my goodness, and things about jobs and positions and jobs and career and getting through school. I've seen the Lord do things where it took 20 years to the day, 16 to the day, 10 years to the day. Eight years to the day, two years to the day, nine months to the day. Ha! Hallelujah! Thank you, God! Hey! Hey, hey, hey! Thank you, Lord! And I've seen the Lord 24 hours where in one day for myself, I didn't have a job as a young woman out of college. And the next day, let me tell you, 24 hours, the next day, two job offers. Hallelujah. And I'm glad I made the choice that I did because that led to the career and where I was supposed to be physically and in the career, every place in my life when I made that choice. Let me tell you, don't give up on your prayers. I've seen people saved. I've seen people delivered. Took 20 years of praying. Uh, uh, 10 years. I've seen where you, where I wanted a position or particular work in my life. Took 10 years, 8 years. I've seen our own mother healed where the doctor said that she wouldn't walk and ha 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 on Thanksgiving Day that particular year after 2 years or a year or so. Well, I know that wasn't the case of months. Six months, thank you, Lord. Six months to the day that she walked on that Thanksgiving day. Now, let me tell you, God is not finished with you. That dream, that vision that you have, he's going to give you peace through it right now. I'm on a faith walk. I'm on a wing and a prayer. Some things in my life right now, right now, as I'm uh, uh, on this uh, June the 3rd, 28th. Believe in the Lord for things in my life And I know I'm called to do what I need to do I'm believing for other people Don't give up 
And I pray that God will give you that kind of peace that nobody can take away. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, in the name of Jesus, I give you praise, honor, and glory for this gorgeous, wonderful, magnificent day. Lord, please forgive us of our manifold sin, our sins of commission, omission, whatever we did, whatever we didn't do, what we should have carried out, we didn't do what we should not have done, oh God, in the name of Jesus. We for I forgive those, and we all forgive those, God, who have sinned against us, and we hold no malice, no bitterness, no unforgiveness, no strife. Lord, help us to walk in love. Help us to walk in peace. Help us to be fully armored with the full arm of God, as I mentioned hallelujah earlier father God in, in this teaching help us God to walk in the fruit of the spirit particularly that fruit of love those nine attributes but that love will cover it all help us dear God to walk in charity no matter what we know how to do well we might have gifts to do this and that but God help us if we don't have love that we are nothing but that tingling symbol that brass nothing help us God to walk in charity love that we love everybody no matter what Lord, I lift up to you those listening right now who are not saved, that they will receive Christ. They will turn from their sin and turn to you, God, before it's too late, that we all will be ready as believers. And, Lord, I lift up to you your chosen people for everything, God, that you want them to have. All of us adopted in because of Jesus Christ, the blood that he shed for all of us, that every knee shall bow, every tongue confess that Jesus Christ is Lord before it's too late. In the name of Jesus. Lord, I believe for healing for those listening to the sound of my voice, or those they're believing for, for provisions, whether it's shelter, a job, uh, records expunged from a criminal uh, record, Father God, a uh, second chance in life, period, uh, for deliverance from an, uh, a, a substance abuse, deliverance from being abused, misused, delivered out of a situation from being the abuser, from being the accuser, from being the one accused, abused. Lord have mercy. Salvation for all concerned. Lord have mercy. Civilians and military, the old, the young, the poor and everybody in their place and space, those of our leaders throughout our nation in every venue, whether the government, businesses, schools, churches, oh God, in the name of Jesus, have your way, Lord. Thank you for peace that passes all understanding in the name of the Father, in the name of the Son, in the name of the Holy Ghost, in Christ Jesus' name, that we walk by faith and not by sight. Amen and amen. Folks, thank you so much for listening to the Rose Highland Sharp Gospel Show. And I pray that you will make Jesus the center of your joy, God the bishop of your soul, the Lord God Almighty, the head of your life before it's too late. He loves you. He's looking out for you. And there is a second chance for you and yours. Don't give up. As always, honey, when you feel like you have nothing else left, you have the Lord. And he's all that you need. And he will supply your every need. I'm going to leave you today with a song by the late Walter Hawkins. And I'm going away. Just a little bit of that for you as we reflect that Jesus would never leave nor forsake you. And I'm going, I might not see you tomorrow, but I see you on the other side that we all make it in. Amen. In God's hands in the new heaven and the new earth. Take care and God bless. And thank you as always. God bless.